Greetings, Vac fans. I have a, something a little different today. I'm going to do a timed test based on nozzle width. So the idea is, if you have a nozzle that's much wider, it should take you less time to vacuum. Now, my wife just recently tried my newest uh, acquisition, this Shark Navigator, and she did like using it, but she realized, why is this taking so long for me to finish a room? And I said, well, the nozzle's a lot smaller than what you're used to, which would be like, say, a Kirby. So let's take a look at the nozzle widths, the interior. I'm going to measure the inside. Okay, this one right here, inside to inside, is about nine and a quarter inches. If I come over here, this is my largest nozzle. This is a Heritage 2 Legend. Inside to inside is 15 and a quarter inches. So approximately 10, approximately 15, there's a 50% difference. So if you have a room that takes you, say, 30 minutes to do with the big guy. If you do it the same way, it would be 45 minutes with this. It would take 50% longer. So to kind of show that, I'm gonna rearrange the camera and we're gonna vacuum my 35 square foot carpet and we'll see how the timing works out. All right, first on the chopping block is going to be the Wide Nozzle Heritage 2 Legend. And I'm going to do things, it's going to seem like it's a little strange, because I'm just going to do a forward and rearward pass, and then I'm going to kind of move the vacuum over laterally, so I don't hit the same piece of carpet twice. All right, here's where you should start your stopwatches. see it was four times laterally. Okay, so now I'm going to get set up and I'm going to do the shark. Same procedure. All right, last we have the shark navigator. The original shark navigator apparently. <laughs> stop your watches. So as you saw, like carpet strips, this one was four strips going laterally. This one was six strips. So 50% more time to get the same job done. 
So I guess what I really want to make a point of is, you know, James Dyson said that they're not going to, as a company, deal with, uh, you know, full-size vacuums. I guess I shouldn't be showing this one here. Why show a curtain? Here. Here's a DC-65. Here. I'll do that. So Dyson said they're not going to do uh, full-size, and also meaning full-size cleaning head, right? They're not going to do that anymore. So they're going to do cleaning heads with stick vacs that are more like this size. And I think the new V10 is probably around 9 inches or so for the nozzle uh, width anyway. So what that means is he's consigned to making people with larger homes vacuum 50% more to get the same job done. So what do you think of that? Thanks for watching.